Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then hi, my name is Floydy. I'm currently a first year medical student at Sri Lanka University, Bangkok, Thailand. And my first year will be ending in a few days because final season is starting tomorrow, actually. Today is currently the 10th of June and my first exam is tomorrow, aka the 11th of June. I'll be having five exams um, during this finals and that will span from tomorrow until the 16th of June. So. Um, I have three days of exams, but five exams to complete. I've taken online exams before in high school, but they were not as strict as this at all. So, you know, I decided it, it, it might be fun to like um, vlog how this exam season goes. You know, it's my first ever online exam experience at uni. Hopefully it will be the last. So I'll be taking you through um, this entire journey of mine. So hopefully you enjoy. I know that you're stressed and we are Currently, um, 12 p.m. sharp. I have to join the Zoom meeting at 12:45. Then we'll be divided into breakout rooms for the exam. Uh, yeah. Um, I think I'll just read through some of my notes from, you know, earlier, and just do nothing other than that. <laughs> I really don't want to stress myself out. So, yeah. Hope it goes well. I guess. <laughs> so this is my exam setup. It. it this is what it will look like during the exam. Um, my laptop will act as my second device and we're doing the exam on our iPads, so it's there. Just finished my human life exam. <laughs> to be honest, it was all right, I suppose, but um, there were some questions that I wasn't sure of because I didn't really revise that much on like certain topics and stuff but i think i did o uh, okay overall i think i'm i think i'm gonna pass definitely yeah but <laughs> yeah it was it was an all right exam i rated an 8 out of 10 i guess <laughs> nothing much it's not that eventful it's sunny at most days you'll never see the sky if you keep looking down and if you take the wrong way Maybe you should stay instead of turning around So that you keep on going I know that you're in the open Hoping that you'll be okay Don't stay looking out the window And how late do you plan on going so I'm back at my condo today because I have uh, two more exams tomorrow. The reason why I can't do my exams at home is because when we're doing the online exams, we have to join Zoom to be like monitored by the invigilators and we have to unmute ourselves the whole time so they can make sure we don't like have external sounds or whatever. And um, I have dogs at home <laughs> and they bark all day long so I cannot stay there and risk, you know, having my dogs bark into the Zoom call. It's 10 p.m. right now and I'm currently trying to revise ethics by reading um, the notes made by people in the academic team of the year group. I'm basically just cramming now because I haven't, I barely touched ethics this past term. So yeah, I hope I hope that tomorrow's exam is just going to be, you know, like, um, common sense based. But, you know, I tell myself that I'm not expecting a good grade. I just want to pass. I say that all the time. And it's true. If I have, um, a, a sense of morality, I should be able to pass. I don't think it would be that hard to pass. Uh, I think I did alright during midterms as well. And, you know, during the small group discussions I participated, I spoke and stuff so i'm trying not to like stress myself out because of this subject alone so 
yeah, I hope tomorrow goes well. Waking up feeling like it's gone away. It's sunny out, but it just comes in waves. When you ask me if I'm okay, I don't have a lot to say. Can't tell you something I do not know. was painful <laughs> I'd say that both exams were not easy <laughs> I bookmarked many questions during the exam like over half of the exams for both subjects but I think I'll be fine as I've mentioned before my step my expectation is just to pass the questions kind of threw me off a bit some of them but most of it I'm just like unsure of. Most of the time I'm like 75% sure. Like I always doubt myself, but that's just how that's just how I am anyway during exams. Well, at least I have only two more subjects to go. I'm over halfway through the this final season, so that's something positive, I guess. <laughs> So I just came back from um, having dinner with my mom and I visited a bookstore and got myself two Murakami books as if I'll have the time to read them I mean I have like six days of summer break Also got myself something to drink because apparently this is my way of coping now I have two more exams to study for and um, even though these ones uh, would probably be easier than the ones we've taken today um, I still don't feel motivated enough to like, you know, properly dive into the content today So I might take a shower and just like relax for a bit, maybe do a bit of studying, but only a little bit I mean, there's not much to go through anyway for these subjects because I'm taking biostatistics, which is basically just math, so like I mean, there's a bit of memorization to do, but it's not like that difficult And the other exam is health and environment, which is purely memorization but most of it i guess we can common sense our way through actually you know what uh, that that might not be true but i deserve to take a break after whatever the hell i've just taken today so i'm just gonna watch netflix and you know just relax and stop thinking about exams hopefully and your great grandfather civil war bayonet and he's selling it for magic beans it's the brand of whiskey he drinks i just i think he deserves a second chance down yeah I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah Can you tell me why, can you tell me why I'm down, yeah No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah Now I'm thinking I, now I'm thinking I Might have caught the June blues, yeah I wanna drown myself inside the juice So it's currently the 15th of June and my last two exams are tomorrow so I'm not looking forward to that because I am very demotivated right now I really don't want to study but um, I'll have to you know fight through the demotivation and do some stuff or else I will die tomorrow probably I just ordered some more food to eat um i was doing work with my friend we were like um talking to each other and doing work together because we both know that we would be extremely um unproductive if we weren't doing work together so <laughs> It's crazy.
currently midnight and my exam is in less than 13 hours but i've been i started this book and i'm already like uh 57 pages in i told myself that i would be studying only tonight but turns out i all i couldn't help but start this book because i didn't want to wait um the anticipation was too strong so yeah Guess who just finished her exams? Me! I finished my exams. And first year is officially over. I'm weirdly hyper right now because I'm gonna go have dinner with my friends, like a celebratory dinner, um, in like half an hour or whatever. Uh, the exam was... I'm honestly, bi uh, biostatistics was like, um, it was the level that I was expecting. It wasn't too difficult, but it also wasn't like the easiest. But health and environment? Wh what was that? The bits that I revised for didn't really appear in the exam. What appeared in the exam turns out to be the bits that I didn't touch at all. Because I didn't think it would be in the exam. There was just way too much information for me to like remember anyway, so... Also, my Zoom, my internet decided to, you know, prank me or whatever because uh, five minutes before the exam ends, my zoom disconnected itself and it took me like five minutes to rejoin so i had to call the professor and told him about it and he was like if you're done with the exam it's fine just rejoin and sit still so we know that you're not cheating or whatever so i was like sure luckily i already finished my exam then so um i rechecked like once or something and yeah it turns out um since the zoom disconnected i had to just submit the exam like that hopefully i'll be fine I mean, I hope I pass. I'm done. It's all done. I don't, I don't want to look at that anymore. <laughs> what if I wake up happy? And what if I wake up sad? Sorry if I said something. Something that made you mad. Wishing that I could call you. Sorry my service bad. My bad. When I wake up, you're not next to me. Guess I'm missing all your energy. So, um, our professors released our results early. Um, not our grades or our raw scores or anything, but basically in the system it just says whether, whether or not we passed. And turns out I passed, um, three subjects so far. The other two subjects that I've taken earlier today, um, the results aren't out yet. But yeah, um, first year is officially over and it just hit me that, um, it's been an entire year since I joined med school and second year starting soon i guess that concludes my vlog um thank you so much for watching i hope that these vlogs can act as like a source of motivation for you guys all right see you bye